Hey guys, this is Next2 here, and right before the video starts, I just want to let you know, I am currently not here right now. I am on vacation because it is summer, and it's time to get crazy. So, I, for the next week, and next week, this week and next week, I'm going to be gone, but videos, as you can tell, are coming up, and this little new series will be here until I return. But don't worry, it's not going to go away before like after I'm back and it's not going to be finished by the time uh, this two weeks are over but it will return soon so if you need to comment or anything I'll see it but I can't really change anything up because I'm not going to be here so that's all bye guys and enjoy the video Hey kiddos, next two here, and welcome to Beautiful Joe. This is a childhood favorite of mine, and just an overall good game on the GameCube. If you haven't played this, you're really missing out and need to go do it now. Hey now, we're not spoiling that. But um, the art style is beautiful, the animation's beautiful, the music's beautiful, the freaking aesthetic, like the movie aesthetic this thing has, beautiful. Everything is beautiful. If not beautiful, it's beautiful. And the music is amazing, and so is the humor. But we're not kids, we're adults. So we are going to play the adult difficulty. Let's get right into this game, brothers and sisters. Also, the cell shading is amazing, I love it. Can't get enough of it. I'm going to drink my water very quietly and hope you don't hear it. Captain Blue fights with every ounce of his being. Megathon. Fights against the dark forces of evil. For what is right. This is all that Blue has ever wanted. To do the right thing. Come on, Blue! You have to save the world! We can't do it without you! Joe, is this your idea of a date movie? I had a more romantic time eating popcorn in the lobby. Joe, honey, um, why don't you show me some off-screen action? <laughs> oh, that was in his mouth that she went down on. I said cut it out. They don't show these old movies all the time, you know. I've been looking forward to this forever. Well, I've been looking forward to this for a long time, too. We haven't been out on a date in forever. Hey, hey, stop that. <laughs> this is the best part. Damn. Up. And thus, Captain Blue was brought to his end. Goodbye, beautiful world. Nothing will ever be the same. It's like the shittiest movie ending I've ever seen. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, I've seen this scene before. You know why? Because this flick hit the screens way back when we were still little babies. But that guy in the blue mask. I know I've seen him somewhere. Uh. 
Hi. Joe is dead. Or not. That shit is huge. It's six machine. Damn. They legit just got pulled in there. Mario style. Chapter one, Joe the hero. Not dead. Hey, wait a minute. Am I am I in inside the movie? Correct, my young friend. I am Captain Blue. I am no longer able to fight because I have been defeated. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. That sentence there. I cannot fight because I've been defeated. I don't know why it just sounds funny the way he said it. No, I am already gone. I beg of you to take up the torch of justice, young movie lover. Now go. The world is in danger. Your lady friend is waiting for you. Go save the world, epic gamer. Oh, there's the V-Watch. Cool. A real V-Watch. <laughs> I always wanted to try one on. Okay, you cannot tell me he does not sound like the freaking guy from Spongebob that's like, ah, I found the coin slot. <laughs> and then he freaking gets kicked by it. Uh, he sounds exactly like that. I'll pull up the audio for it at some point. I can't find the coin slot. Here it is. Oh, yep. It's tutorial time. So you see an enemy and he punches and you dodge him. And he kicks and you dodge him. And then he gets all disoriented and he's like, oh no. And then you just beat him up. I never knew what these things were. I always assumed they're like sock puppet monsters, but I always found them super creepy. Yeah, I always found these things terrifying. But yeah, man, beautiful Joe. Gotta take out three of these boys. Punch me, boys. Punch me. Ooh. What do you mean I got a B on that? That was perfect. I hate you. Game. Freaking lying about my points. Almost got hurt there. Punch me. And then these ones, you gotta wait for them before you can kill them. Beautiful. Oh, it's him. As a hero. I'll show you how to be a real hero. I thought he just said he couldn't fight like two seconds ago. Whoa, the game is not liking this. Punch me. Dead. Finished. Ooh, rainbow beautiful. Your hero has awakened. Now the village is responding to your hero instincts deep down inside. When the watch 
starts to glow. Say the word. Henshin a go go, baby. Henshin a go go, baby. Yeah. There's the cape. You want some? We'll come and get it. We, we got the slow mo. Yep, we could go slow mo now. Bat! Get over here, bat. Okay, goodbye, bat. No, stop following me. I'm gonna kill you, bat. Oh, Joker! Oh my god, I forgot about this guy. This guy's epic. I love Joker, he's so awesome. What's up, Joker? How's it been? Oh. Well, that's Joker. Forgot you kill him in one hit if you get him on time. But Joker unlocks this. The slot machine. And you might be looking at this and be like, Oh man, this could be hard, but nope. You can slow down time. Get that. Where's the thing, yo? Oh, I missed it. But yeah, you can slow down that with that. That's pretty epic. And boom. Just like that, you're rich. Beautiful. Beautiful. Joe. And now we're done. Oh, I got hit. Yep, good thing those things drop that. Oh, wow. Oh. Wow, I'm, my timing is terrible. Ton of eatables. Whoop. Alrighty. Oh, now we're good. This is the part where I could never get past as a kid, because I was like, how do you fight this guy? But now I'm a pro at it, because this guy comes at you, and he shoots bullets at you, and you're like, hmm, how do you fight those bullets? But it's simple, you just gotta slow down time, and boom, you could punch the bullets right back. And boom. We have achieved our goal. But not after doing this. Because these pieces are important to get. Because the more, uh, every 50 we get, we unlock a new one of that movie slot at the top of our screen. And that allows us to slow down time for longer, which is very important. And slow down time is not just for fighting. See, look, we can slow down these and the propellers move slower. Which means they fall down and now they are ground level. And slowing down also makes explosions bigger. 
which becomes super useful when it comes to fighting enemies. And we'll see more as to why this is useful later on. Okay, he didn't want to come down. But yeah, when there's no slowdown, those things are useless. Oh, oh, I. Man. Damn you, get over here. You know what, I don't have enough time for you. But yeah, you slow down this and boom. Like cake. And that comes down, and now you're able to go continue to level. And then you just hop on up here. And voila. Crappy. Oh, come on. Okay, so they're both dead. Oh, come on, that thing slowed me just so I'd land on that. Wow, I just let that happen. Ah, oh, there's the one I need. And we're done. Well, that was terrible. are very important. And boom, a whole new thing. Uh-oh, what's this? A freaking helicopter crashes through the ceiling? Eh, it's nothing for Joe. Oh. oh yeah. Oh yeah, if you touch something in slow-mo, you automatically dodge it. So we're finding this big old helicopter, and you're like, hmm, how are we gonna fight this thing? Well, there's a specific way you do it, and I'll show you just how. Because as you can tell, it shoots bullets, you can just slow down time to avoid its bullets. But that's not how you beat it. And look, I can slow down time to make it fall to the ground, right? And punching it isn't doing anything either, so this is kinda useless, huh? Well, there's a way around it. Damn. Oh, I kinda got stuck. Oh, here it comes. This is how you beat the boss. You see these missiles here? You punch one, you punch two, and they go back. And then you just let them blow up. That is how you beat the boss. You hit the missiles back. Oh, okay, that hits me, cool. Oh wow, I'm getting stuck all in them. Oh, I thought that hit me. Nah, bro. A single one of them? Really? Oh my god. No, don't come back. Don't come back. Oh, oh, that almost hit me. That was so close to hitting me. 
But yeah, he's almost dead already. And we are doing perfect. Oh, that was a late jump. I keep messing that up. Yo. Done. Just give up, brother. Just give up. Whoa. Okay. Uh oh. That was the awkward part of it. When there's enemies on the stage, the missiles won't target the right character. And that's why you need to make sure the missiles get dealt with, or the people get dealt with. And boom, we won. Just like that, baby boys. That's how you defeat a helicopter. Whew. That was stressful. I, don't know. I used to hate those things as a kid because I could not beat them for my life. We're going to save. Ignore that. You don't see that. That doesn't exist. Uh, I was just testing out the profile earlier. Like, the other day, or two days ago, I don't know how many days ago that was, but I was testing it out. Cause you know, gotta make sure the game works before I play it. Mao, this is the awesome upgrading shop. Where you can buy tons of upgrades. Um, yeah, this, uh, this is an epic thing. Doubles the rate of your recovery of your VX gauge. Gauge. I don't know why I say gouge. Even if all your lives are gone, restart from the point where you died. Hmm. We're gonna wanna buy that. Like over any upgrade. And then the next one we're gonna get. Yeah, that's about it. We'll just save our money after that. But having health is very important to this game. So let's move on. Ooh, scary. Just go for it. This is another thing that took me like 16 million hours to figure out. Whoa. Because Kid Nick's like, how do you do this? Well, you slow it down, and boom. Just like that. Oh, no, 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 stop! Don't slow me down! No! Damn you. Is it even worth killing them? Is it worth it? No, it was not. Bro, Hell yeah. Oh, whoa, that almost hit me. And we're done. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna say it's bad. Blind man. Oh. Well, you just made it super easy to kill them all, so thank you, sir. Oh, well, there he goes. 
Oh, oh, there he goes again. Dang it. Yeah, get down here. And the boom. Whoa. -oh. Joe, it's time for your next trial. Hope you're warmed up, cause ready or not, here I come. He's back, boys. But this time we're about to kick his ass. Cause we can stop him from being in slow-mo. His shields are nothing to us now. Whoops. Oh, yeah, I forgot about his electricity. And he's done. And now we have super speed. Oh yeah, now we have super speed. We have super slow and super speed. So we can slow down time, or we can speed up time. Now as you can see... Boom! Just like that. And I happen to love mock speed because you move 10 times faster than you would have any other reason. Oh damn, we almost have all these in the level. The more of these you get in the level, the way better you do. So look how long I can use my powers now. Like, ta-da. Oh, I can't go up there. Uh-oh. And boom, we're done. What do you mean V points? I'm not fighting anything in there, you psycho. I mean, I could have, but why would I do that? Oh, wow, that hit me. I don't think burning them does anything to me besides the visual effects. I am low on health, and I should not be this low for what's coming up. Oh no. Dead. Uh oh. Scary spike man's coming. That's about it. Oh no, how do you turn these on? Boom. Oh, boom. Boom. And boom. And that's that. I'm pretty sure we're approaching a boss. But I'm not entirely sure. Beautiful flying punch kick combo attack. Sure, let's buy that. Let's buy Air Joe. Move on. Punch kick, punch kick, jump, punch kick, jump, jump, punch kick, punch kick, kick, punch. Yeah, this is definitely the boss. Oh, that's a cool move. I like that. Okay, that's cool. Okay, yeah, that's cool. Uh, yeah, it's definitely first boss. Alrighty, it's gonna be awesome and freaking fight him. Boom. Uh oh, shouldn't have punched that. Ch 
Charles the Third. Oh, dad, this bad idea is me. Captain has heard this movie is already over. <laughs> Captain Blue's defeated, and we are victorious. <laughs> Shows you what you know, bat brain. In movies, there has to be a plot twist. That means things always go wrong once before you get to the happy ending. Hello? Now, come on. Let's get this over with. Dip, oh, what nonsense is this? Come like all the ritual and sacrifice will be giving you a pathetic little world will... Oopsie poopsie! <laughs> Almost left the cat out of the bed there! <laughs> In any case, this has nothing to do with Rick Rap like you. I can barely hear him. Oh, I forgot he does that. Whenever you fight the boss, he, his armor like goes into that. And it looks super dope. So yeah, that's basically all you have to do. Oh, yeah, basically you just gotta wait for an opportunity. That could have been bad. But yeah, just wait for a good opportunity, and then, uh, you hit him. Can you get over here? Oh, that's even better. Oh, come on. Wow, that was lame. Ooh, almost hit me. Oh, damn. He has, like, no health, bro. Dead. Dead. <laughs> Sorry to wake you up. You can sleep as much as you want now. Joe wanders into the world of the movies and gallantly fights evil to rescue Sylvia. With the help of his superior strength, he is able to reign triumphant over the dastardly bad man, Charles III. Where could Sylvia be? Is she safe? Is she even alive? Intolerable anxiety tears at Joe's heart. What did they do to her? What did they do to her? What would be a good hero need? I never thought this would be so hard. Searching for Sylvia, Joe tries to track clues as to her whereabouts. Little did he know that the clues would only lead him to more problems. The next episode is some like it red hot. See you there. See you all next time. Hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We stream every other day. I don't know if we're streaming. Oh, wait, I'm not even around right now. <laughs> yeah, I have to announce that next time. But whatever. We'll see you all next time. Bye, guys.